Have you worked with Joss before? I have not. Okay. What was that like? Right. Awesome. Yeah. Yeah, I mean, it's great to just be able to work with him and have the opportunity to kind of pick his brand. I mean, he's been around doing so many different things in so many cool ways. Um, and I think what was most exciting to me, what appealed to me most, was his ability to connect with the audience. He's sort of cultivated that over a long period of time. And, like, I'm after that, too, like, I would love to connect and, and figure out how to talk directly to them. The opportunity to do that was great. Yeah. Did he uh, have a lot of day-to-day -day interaction? Yeah, I mean, Josh is involved, heavily involved in, in uh, casting. Like, he and I, first we did table, table Read. I haven't seen it. Uh, Started with my look, my feel, what I wanted to do with it. Totally signed off on that. Had some notes that I adjusted to. Casting, we kind of went out and got who we wanted. And we agreed to. And the great thing about Joss is he doesn't really, it's not about sort of getting the best name, it's getting the best person for the role. And, uh, and then just involved in watching dailies and then in and out of the editor. Great. Uh, Michael talked about how the cast sort of filmed separately. Yeah. Was that I mean, a challenge directing? It's a challenge, but I was sure that they're always there for each other right. so they're always reading off camera even though like we're in New Hampshire Michael's character is not in New Hampshire right. but he was there to read off and I think that really helped him like immediately kind of get a connection and Zoe and, and Michael are just amazing in the movie like there is a great connection between them. I think part of it is because of that I mean, it was, that was the strategy thank you so much